Hey guys, welcome to the vault. We're back with some more exclusive content. Um, Ariel, Jason, Leon, and Pierre here. We're joined by uh, the two fellas from Off the Dome Podcast, Lonnie and Isebic. We're here to give you guys an ep episode of Keepers, Sleepers, and Weepers. Hope you guys enjoy. Pierre, take it away. It's Jesus, damn it. <laughs> That's a new one, Yasebic. I've never heard that one. I've heard I've said that before. Yasebic is a good one, though. I said it because because I didn't know I didn't know at first, right? So like I was re I would just go by what your Instagram handle no, was. Everybody has a their own unique way at first when they first see the whole Instagram <laughs> oh, handle. I say yeast is big, like big pens, like yeast is big. Yeah. Yeah. Is yeah. that right? Yeah. No, it's not right. His name is Jesus. All right. So you guys ready to get started here? <laughs> no, but what what is the B I C for? It's B I C. It's not big. I think that you just said it. Oh, Jesus B I C. Yes. There it is. Okay, man. Right. There it is. Just so yours is very simple. It's like snap. Dot SPG. Man, snap. Now it's now it's yeah, a lot of dots involved. Oh man. I fucking hate this app. Oh <laughs> boy. <laughs> All right, this is my turn. Oh shit. So, <laughs> so, hey, can I ask I a question? What the hell happened to you? What's the crutches for? What happened? Well, I actually like last year around this time I, I broke my heel. Ooh. Oh so, shit. That's oh, surgery. That? Yeah. It's it's a long story, but did you yeah. kick somebody? No, I wish I wish it was that cool. You know what I mean? Like, oh, so it's not a cool story. If you're not no, gonna tell not, us. Yeah, I'm not telling that. Yeah. <laughs> 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 like, going down the stairs or something like that. It's bad vibes. But, but yeah, this Dodgers hat is is completely horrible. I, I've always hated this Dodgers logo, but in this color, it's even worse. It looks like diarrhea is like shooting from the sky. I don't know. This is horrible. <laughs> and then you got the whole back panel. Horrible. Like like diarrhea side patch awful color blocking no contrast uh, diarrhea bottom this is what what more do you have to say this shit is horrible nah this, this is, is brown this is a bad hat which pro image is responsible for this one Toledo uh, yeah you know I mean you gotta shout him out <laughs> <laughs> the home of LeBron James hmm. well he was Canton right is yeah he whatever Akron? Akron? I don't give a Akron. shit Akron. Ohio, it all fucking sucks. The whole state. <laughs> Jesus. Except for Cincinnati. Hmm. All right. Well, that's a good weeper, uh, Jesus. Nice job. Good I'm find. Like, Leon, right. can you change my weeper to Ohio? Uh, <laughs> sure. Yeah, okay. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, this fucking crown is horrible. Um. Yeah. It just doesn't make any sense to me. Like, even if I like, if I was a Lakers fan, why would I want this hat? Right? You like, wouldn't be. You wouldn't be one anymore after yeah, seeing this hat. I wouldn't. Yeah, no. I would. I probably wouldn't be a Lakers fan. <laughs> <laughs> no. You wear this to the. You wear this to a game. They're gonna boo you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, shit, it's funny because you got the that's L on the side patch, and that just sums it up right there. It's no. Just, <laughs> look at him. Like this guy's a fucking poser. Who is it? <laughs> you yeah. Wear that to the you're game. banned from. You're banned from. Uh, was it Crypto Arena or? Whatever they call it these days, it's, 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 it's Staples, right? Staples Arena. Uh, no, they renamed I think Crypto dot com. I think. Or oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. That's Either way. Name. So, Lonnie, are you a basketball fan? I watch some basketball. Yeah. You LeBron or Jordan? I'm. So... I'm a Jordan fan. All right. I'm a Jordan fan, but LeBron is great. You know, like I can't. Oh, no, I'm not saying he's here. Which one do you take over those two, though? Like to play, like. Yeah, yeah. Who's the bet? Who's the who's the go? You're start. You're starting the team. You got your first draft pick. I'm I'm going Jordan because I want I want I want somebody that's going to be ruthless on the court. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> how about you? How about you, Jesus? You got you got uh, you a basketball guy or no? Yeah, I mean, I grew up hating Jordan because I was a Knicks fan, so I would yeah. take Michael Jordan mm -hmm. anytime I could. Fuck that. Yeah, nah. I like you guys more already. <laughs> that cemented it. That cemented it for me. That's Snap is a LeBron guy. All right, let's move on here. <laughs> Oof. Oh, yeah, Ooh. man. This is highlighter hell. Uh, <laughs> horrible hat. Um, yeah, this lavender, this highlighter. Even a mother wouldn't love this hat. If, if I showed my mom this hat, I said, "Mommy, look at the hat I made." She said, "Oh no, the meal of la basura." Yeah, no, no, this ain't good. This Yankees is not it. Who's responsible for this? This is a new era spring program hat. You'll be seeing these things all over the place. 
this is what they were asking us. This is what he was asking me to post. Yes, yes. Nah, man, I ain't posting that. No. <laughs> <laughs> Who wanted you to post? <laughs> nah, there's there's a store that reached out. Reached out. They they thought they had you know the first yeah the first one to drop these, and I'm we're like no, nah, we're not. I'm not posting this. But they probably you don't want rid of them faster. You don't want me to post this. Yeah, yeah and I don't yeah, see anybody have... with a size eight wearing this either. They had no, to order I'm, this. I'm though, right? eight and I'm not putting that on my head. And I and I love that color combination. If you know me personally. Really, neon green with like Air Max ninety five. That's that's one of my favorite colorways. But oh, no, this is like not, yeah, this is you, you should leave it. I can see it on a sneaker, but not on a hat. This this is lavender, not gray, though. Oh, listen, what? if you're talking about the- <laughs> yeah, that's lavender. Yeah. Oh shit! I was gonna say those gold ninety five. Those gold ninety five you're talking about don't God. have any lavender on them. That's for sure. Yeah. yeah. What? Right there. I don't understand why are we wasting fabric like this? So many people want to make hats and are limited and have to wait, and then we're we're just wasting the fucking fabric on shit like this. Oh my! I God. You, Lonnie, I agree with you. I agree with you. This is a waste of fabric. But I will say this, and I and I and I'm saying I mean this honestly, like. Now there is they stores can buy hats now. So if yeah. anyone's telling you they can't buy hats now, they're lying. Okay, they yes. can all buy hats now. There, there, there's been so much opened up allocation now. Everybody can buy hats for the most part, but still a waste of fabric. Yeah, definitely. It's a waste of a good textile. Right? Is this a good textile though? No, <laughs> that green man, I, I, Lonnie. I'm not with you. That volt. That's a lot of volt. Well, listen, Leon. Leon is Whoa, known to you love know what's crazy. Game. I have the shoe right here. Look, look. You see? Yeah, I love the yeah, shoe. It looks great, right there. Because there's a there's great. a little yeah. a little bit of vault on there. Yeah, not, it's, subtle. Shoe, it's subtle. All of the vault. It's subtle. Yeah. I you can't know what my favorite it. one, Lonnie? Remember the burnt orange ones like that? Yes. Yes. I, those are my yeah. favorites, actually. But they don't, they don't bring them out enough. Like uh, the burnt orange ones are my favorite. Yeah, no, they don't. But Nike ID, honestly, I. Well, there was a time where you could basically do every like that same gradient on yeah, this, yeah, but yeah. then change the color. Yeah, I should have taken advantage. Right, of right there on that shoe. It's I know beautiful. you're right. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love nine. I love Air Max ninety fives. It's one of my favorites. It's just looking at somebody's head and just seeing that on somebody's head is like, oh yeah, yeah. You're gonna look away because it's too bright. Yeah. Like as soon this as that pop like the screen, my side. eyes went. You know what's funny about neon green though, like that? It gets as dirty as white does. Yeah. Like you can look at you can see you you can't you just see that happy and dirty in a week? Yeah. Like it, it looks even worse. It'll attract dust really fast. Yeah, those have that because neon green is as bad as white. Because it's like radioactive. I'm so still bugging that yeah. this is lavender. Like yeah. <laughs> when Leon when you submitted this to when when Snap submitted this to Leon, Leon had to go change his keeper. <laughs> 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 All right, let's let's move on. Uh, my weeper of the week comes from New Era um, with this Greek filigree uh, reverse white panel. It's almost like a reverse Jason Mead because he likes the white panel front hats. But I don't know what the hell they were thinking uh, with these. The double up logo filigree, it's just terrible. Uh, th- these actually have the. Uh, these are like side panel hats because the back is the same as the front. Oh my! These are God. these are pinwheels. Oh. Even worse. Yeah. yeah, yeah, way worse. Yeah. yeah so if you need help, uh, hit up uh, Snapback God. Um, his uh, handles right there. Oh my! Oh God. shit! Okay, so I don't know what happened, but I obviously somebody at the Baltimore Orioles pissed off somebody at Fanatics because. Whenever they do these these colorways, they fucking abuse this bird. Like it's always the worst one in the pack, hands down. And this one is is uh, yeah, is probably the one of the worst ones we've ever seen. I don't see color blocking like that. I don't know. Don't mess with this bird, man. Yeah. I don't know what it ever did to you. Just let it be. Let it fly south. <laughs> And, and let, let, it, let it go off in retirement, and and yeah, leave the bird alone. You don't need you don't need to kick it. That's essentially what fanatics did to this hat. So they kicked the bird in the face until it turned purple. Punchable bird. 
considered <laughs> having this hat in my weepers. I'm not gonna hold you. This was this just yeah. Close. No, that's just fucking disgusting. Ugly, man. All right. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry. These things are fucking shit, man. I mean, like, it's like as lazy as it gets, man. It's like this looks like if anyone else put these out, these are they're getting roasted for these. But if anyone else put oh. these out, it would be even worse. These look like mm -hmm. fanatics hats, but you just say they're like Snapple hats. Like these, that's what you know. It's, these are bad, man. I miss the hat club that I that I grew up on, man. With like just nice Back clean hats, day. like. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm being serious. I feel you though. Day, that's the same. But even for me, like 15 years ago with Hat Club, 10, 12 years ago with Hat Club, like it was just like they had good shit, man. This stuff is like, this is bad, man. These are bad it's hats, tough man. Tough for him because it's like you've seen the decline. You've seen it at its peak, and then now it's just. Listen, it's like it's like it's like watching like a, a close relative kind of like dwindle off. You know, it's like it's sad, man. It's like it's terrible. Like you're watching it. And it's the commercialization of it all. That's what it is. You guys touched yeah. on this show, and I'll tell you what it is: is like these. Everyone loved things when they're smaller and they feel more organic and they feel more connected to what they're trying to do. And then when things get corporate, it doesn't feel as good. And this is the this this has gotten so corporate now. And the reason why you both love the collaboration so much is because, and I don't want to put words in your mouth, but for me, from watching it from afar, it's because you connect with it. We it's don't more organic. We don't connect because we've been we've grown up in this environment of like collaborations and feeling small. And when Hack Club was like just like it felt little, right? And now it feels big. And once it feels big like that, it doesn't. It's not as good. It's just not as good. That's why. Mm. That's why these mom and pop shops, I think, and these boutiques are more important to hack culture because those are the ones that are going to keep it really to the hack culture. Mm -hmm. You know, when you have a big corporation like this, it's become money now. It's become all about money. And let's just turn style out a bunch of fucking hats. And that's what this looks like. And that's why it's my weeper of the week. When's the last time they did a cool, like, retro gray bottom minor league hat? Uh, that they used to do. Uh, last week. They've been doing them. Yeah. Week before last, they had a couple. A couple. They're, but they used to do them, like, every, like, four or five, like, every Monday. They mm -hmm. did. Yeah. They did. But I thought like things like the black domes, like stuff like that. Yeah, like, that's great. Yeah, I don't know, man. These are just this is my weeper, man. These suck. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Topper store, Arizona script. I really like this hat a lot. We talked about it on the show. The little hints of purple in the in the logo. The bronze mm -hmm. on on the on the brown. Yeah, gray bottom, white guts. I love this hat. Uh, this is this is so clean for me. It's a really good hat. I tried. Solid. I tried to pick this one, but Leon told me no. Now I see why. Yeezus, yeah. yeah. you want to know how many freaking inaugural season patches I have in my collection? I must have hundred and eighty of those fuckers. <laughs> Everywhere. It's a good patch. Yeah. <clears throat> I love this patch. Yeah, it's one of my faves. Uh, yeah, shout out to for you. This world, you, when it comes to the script logos, I'm like one of the I, I don't, I'm not a big fan of them, but mm -hmm. when I when I see certain ones, it's like it's just exciting, it gives me a like original feeling, you know. Like, this, this is one of those, this is one of those crowns that do it for me. <laughs> um, yeah. world blue, um, black top visor, and I believe it's a green. Classical to me, right? It's a green undervisor. And yeah, I don't remember green or gray. Either way, yeah, one of the two. Either way, it's gonna be good. It was a patch too. I forget what patch was on this. It was the twenty fifth. It was the twenty fifth anniversary. Yeah. The round I can one. Tell you what, it's not. It doesn't have a fuchsia undervisor, so we're good. No, no. It's yeah, classic. We this yeah, we saw this hat in person when we went to for you. Mm -hmm. Great. How was that experience at, at for you for you? There was a fry Kennedy fried chicken next to it, and I told that <laughs> motherfucker. Oh yeah, there's there's a lot of good food on that block. A lot and, of good food. Um, the store was really dope. It was big. It, I like the way they had the the hats in the glass cases. Yeah, it was it was it was lit. The spear, why didn't you? Store is good as well. 
Why didn't you take me to Kennedy's fried chicken? <laughs> um, I don't, I don't know what it would do to a man of your age, your insides. So, oh, my insides are destroyed, so it wouldn't do anything. Listen, just make sure <laughs> sandwiches. That, that's where the original great chicken sandwich came from. Not Popeyes, mm-hmm. any yeah. one of these places, Kennedy's. Yeah. All right, next time I'm there, we're going to Kennedy's. No, when, while I was eating the chicken in there, I was like like screaming and giving them like their praise. And the <laughs> owner came out from the back and was like, who is this guy? He said, "He said, does it taste the same? And I said, man, it tastes the same as I when I left 20 years ago. Oh, it was good. It was some good ass. The gre- there was it was so greasy. The grease, like I had a I had like a, a drumstick, right? The grease was literally dripping onto my fucking Jordan threes. Oh, and shit. I was like, it was that greasy. Oh, I've never seen that. <laughs> no, I that love sounds, it. That know, sounds it absolutely so fucking delicious. It no, Lonnie, so I'm telling you, I took it out of the little bag, and the it, it was right out of the grease. Right, Ooh, this thing was they, like, the, yeah. It was, it has, it has, the chicken has it is this unique smell to it. It just you smell it. And you're like, oh, I want seasoned. It just smells seasoned. It's yeah, just right. but you know what's the craziest part about all this? So we're in there, right? And the owner comes out from the back because Snap's just being fucking loud. And the guy's like, and, and Snap's like, it's been like 25 years since I've been here since I've eaten at one of these. And the guy thinks he's talking about that restaurant, right? That specific spot. And he's like. Is it, he said, does it still taste the same? He wasn't saying it like, does it still taste? He was saying because he was there. Is it still as good as when I was here 25 years ago? And he and Snap wasn't understanding what he was saying. He was basically asking Snap, did you come here 25 years ago? Yeah. Does it taste the same? Because I was here 25 years ago. Yeah, all the, the candies corner. taste the same. The one on the corner. You know you when you're, said, you should have said, yeah, you we might have gotten the extra piece of chicken. You yeah. know what's going on? The, right, right, Lonnie, the one with the subway right above it. It's got the subway track right above it. You know, it's right or the train track yeah, right yeah, above yeah. it. That yeah. one, I feel like that's, that one's pretty busy. It was slow when we went in there. Okay. It was slow, but, but, but I like um, it. It was, was good though. It was off the chain. It was good. All right. All right. Let's see what snap picked. Yeah, man. Listen, driving through New York and seeing all of these buildings and stuff, I saw these brownstones, the hacks. I was like, what? I just drove through all this shit. Yes, give me these hats. And I feel like they were slept on, man. I seen uh, full-size runs on all of these hats. I don't know, is it because they ordered a shitload of them or people just didn't no, care about the brownstones? Pe- people were dogging these. A lot of people were dogging these. And I'm like, I, I don't know why. These are good hats. Yeah, I mean, just seeing the the architecture in New York and the buildings and all of that, and then they came out with the commercial to this to the to this to this uh, collection. I was like, I was all in. I said, I want it. I was just there. Give me them. I want to take a piece of New York back with me. They got too big, man. I'm telling you, that's what's going on. They got too big, and now they got too big. All right, my sleeper of the week is this uh, Milwaukee Brewers hat. It almost feels like a part two of that uh, beer hook he did earlier in the summer. Um, but, yeah, just a really cool uh, Milwaukee Brewers script. Full-size run. I think he still has a special right now. Buy three, get one free. Um, either way, topper star. Come on with the heat. Milwaukee Brewers for me. Leon's a son of a bitch. I, I submitted this as my sleeper, way. and Leon said, nope, you can't have it. Now, now look what happens. He, he took it. This yeah. was actually his best hat from those two slides y'all showed me. Mm-hmm. I didn't get to tell him that. So happened. No, but you got oh, to tell you... him your life fucking story and how much you love him. Yeah. So we're all good. Yeah, man. I mean, he's good. Mm-hmm. That is was... you, Jay. Oh uh, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, I saw this one. I you know I didn't really pay this one much attention when it dropped, but then I saw it in the show. I kept seeing it. I'm like, this is a damn good hat. I like the the orange and the brown together. The classic A logo. Um, I just actually just went and bought this one. This one's like, hooked to something. Almost looks like an A and W. Yeah, could be, could be. If if you say it's hooked to something, the snap will love it. No, they, there's no A and Ws in in Russia. I don't know. I don't think so. First of all, he's not in fucking Russia. And and that is, those are the A and W have, uh, colors. Have you yeah, ever they, taken they a geog- Austria? Have you ever taken a geography class? Ever or looked at a map? Ever? How far is Austria from Russia? 
it's it's quite a ways. But anyway, it's very uh, nice and, he, and he has he has been to the United States quite a few times and probably seen an A and W. Well, I mean, if you've seen Menace to Society, you probably saw A and W. So you're right; it is an A and W hat. Hmm. Either way, it's a good looking hat. He Full size run still available. You saw Menace to Society. I did not think he ever saw that movie. All right, here's my here's here's my sleeper of the week. I went with his Mets hat. You know, I like the I love the side patch that 25th anniversary of the Miracle Mets in 1969. I like green cord. I think the green looks really nice with the orange. I just thought this was a really nice hat, man. Uh, you know, listen, there it's not for everybody. Cord's not for everybody, but this one's sitting in just about a full size run at time of recording here. Um, I thought it was a, a a great hat. That's my sleeper of the week coming from Hat Club. You redeemed yourself from your fucking Snapple hats. <laughs> yeah, uh, keepers. I really love this uh, Texas from Ronnie Fitteds and Caps Boise, uh, mm-hmm. Vegas Gold Crown. I really like the color blocking on the logo. Uh, the red really pops it out. Mm-hmm. Uh, final season side patch. Nice colors on the side patch as well as a little green and purples and stuff. Yeah, I like mm-hmm. that hat a lot. Not mad at this at all. Mm. As one of my keepers. Ron, Ronnie does a pretty good job making some hats. That's for sure. Beautiful. Yeah. And then, uh, yeah, mm. Ecap City. Nice choice. Re- wow. I really like this Giants hat right here. I, this is about like probably the third time I've seen the the off white uh, graphite combination, and I and I'm yeah. really liking that. Uh, mm-hmm. I'm not sure what kind of red this is. It's almost like a scarlet in the logo, but um, color blocking is the it? logo is perfect. That's metallic, metallic red. Yeah, that's metallic. metallic red. That's metallic okay. scarlet. There you go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you got that. Oh, gold a little bit of gold right. in there too. Yeah, that's good. I believe the side patch also glows, where it's, uh, the tell the goodbye glows. If yeah. it's an ECAP City hat and it's a white thread, you know it's glowing in the dark. <laughs> yeah. Right bottom. I like this. This is this is super clean for me. Yeah, that's a good ah, hat too. Really, really, really mm-hmm. good hat. You know what's interesting is that the the um, metallic red, depending on which factory makes it, um, could look like pinkish. So they actually uh, they actually uh, won the roll of the dice there because mm-hmm. that was made somewhere where it looks actually red. That's a really good choice. Uh, you use this nice hat. Mm-hmm. Very good choice. Shout out, shout out to my fitness. Shout out to John G. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about this Giants cap right here. I lo- This shit is a fucking movie, right? Look at the patch. It almost looks as if it's moving by itself, right? Like, <laughs> um, and I'm usually one not 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 for off white crowns, but this, mm. you know, it, it's like art to me. So I need it. <laughs> this green under visor. You won't see many people walking around the United States with this hat, right? Like I need it. <laughs> yeah. Did you get will... one? Did you get one, Lonnie, or no? Nah. I, I last couple weekends have just been busy for me, and oh, I, I missed out on this. Yeah. This is what this. I thought the Arizona one was the best from that pack, right? From the first part of it. Mm-hmm. This is here? the U-Haul, right? Yeah. This is the yeah. U-Haul. This is the one that didn't show up in time, but this one ended up. Once I got this one in hand, I was like, "Yeah, this is the better one." Yeah, this is this is great. I really okay. like this logo a lot. The the yellow ball behind the purple. What is that? It's like purple, red. Yeah, there's some red in there. There's some purple. It's like, it, dude, this is a really nice hat, man. Yeah, it looks even better in hand. Uh, yeah, really, really like this crown a lot. I'm having. I wish I got it. I don't have it, so it's on the girl list. Hopefully, you know, I catch it out there. The reason why I didn't get this hat because I was like, it looks a lot like my U-Haul hat that I already have. I was like, nah. But that doesn't make you want to complete a set. Well, well, I mean, I, 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 I'm, I'm all into buying the whole pack. Yeah. No, no, but, no, not, not buying a whole pack. But you know, sometimes you know you want that two clip. You know, like it's just the. Yeah. I got yeah, this. Yeah, I like that too. You know. Yeah, I got the, I got the Rockies one. I was happy with the Rockies. Okay. My man. Yeah. But this I needed that side patch. I'm a big fan of that All Star Game okay. side patch. Whenever it's done properly, you know, mm. it can it can go it can go very bad, but it went very well. I post, <laughs> I posted this right, and someone's like, "Oh, the colors on that side patch suck." What? Yeah, I posted it on one of my pictures in hand. I'm like, "What are you?" I, I just ignored it. So sometimes it's like, yeah. "Whatever, man." I just 
that whoever that person was only saw six slide six hats on that uh, new era color slide we just saw earlier. Yeah. Yeah, the color blind test slide. These are good. These are good hats, man. This is a yeah, good hat. Nice choice, really man. Special pounds. Mm. Shout out to Chance the Gator, man. And then we got both. We got we got the, the one that's coming out this weekend and, and yeah. this past weekend. This is a yeah. duel that, that I feel like I need. <laughs> right? Like mm. we got we What's... got some, we got something for every day. The white and green, well, off white with the green, and then if you want that little pizzazz, the red. Yep. You can you can only get one. Which one are you getting? If I can only get one, mm-hmm. I think I would do the first one. With that, P- watch out Pierre, for the P- Pierre was wearing this hat when we was in New York, and the amount of compliments he got. For this hat was like I was like, God damn, okay, I'm gonna buy it too. Yeah. I mean, it was women throwing themselves left and right over him to, over his goddamn hat. You know, he's he's making joke. No, he's he's well, making light. Of it. He's making light of it, but no joke, man. People were stopping me about that hat, man. Nice. And I said, like Holy that. shit! I said, Let me get this yeah. hat. Man. Last week, I'm I'm, re- I'm really feeling it that I didn't touch either crown last week. So now I was just like. I knew I knew what what I what hats I was picking when you guys asked. <laughs> and don't and don't sleep on the plain Jane either, man. That's a good hat too. Nah, it's, man. it's nice, but be, if I had to pick between the two, I like the patchwork. You know, it's a it's a nice yeah. detail, yeah. great hook. So it's just that that would be the one for me. Yeah, yeah. The, no, I'm with, I'm with you. I prefer the green one. I prefer yeah, the, the plain, one Jane, the plain Jane would be the would be the the. The salt I'm throwing on people like you don't got this. You don't got this. That's what I did with that. That's what I did with that picture, Lonnie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was looking for pictures and I was like, I don't think I know anybody with this way. I'm like calling you guys. Yeah. Right. Here we go. My keeper, Los Angeles script from Fan Treasures. Mm. Yes, Lord. This hat is on its way to my house as we speak. The Dodger Stadium side patch. I love it. Icy, icy, icy. I, I'm just. I, I'm. I'm. I'm glad it's not L.A. anymore. It's Los Angeles, and I had to get it, and I love it. And this is a keeper from Fan Treasures, John DeMario. You did your thing. Wow. All right, you got the you got the vowel at the end wrong. It's John DeMaria. John DeMario. No, you know, you know, you just said it wrong. John yeah. DeMarco. You know how they say John DeMarco, John DeMario. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not every time on his name, man. Mario. Put some respect on the name. All right. Let me see. Let's, let's go to the next slide. The next keeper. Oh, yes. Listen. As the, the picture doesn't do it justice now that I saw Yeezus wear it. I'm like, holy moly, guacamole. I can't wait for this to come home to daddy. Listen, they might say it's a Kanye West. I say it's a Chicago Bulls playoff hat. I love it. Bert Deans, Jerry, and whoever was the person that did the collab. Nah, great just job. Shots <laughs> Shout to Differently Uptown. Love yeah. it. I don't know about the pin though, but I love everything else. All right. My keeper of the week comes from Still. Um, they dropped this real tree Toronto Blue Jays hat. It reminds me of the uh take care hat they kind of dropped earlier with the olive and the brown, but this time with uh real tree. I don't know, I just really like it. Um they're doing some cool stuff over that still. Yeah, I think this is really cool. Just just off uh earlier, um <laughs> well, what was said, uh it's a bird in the tree. Yeah, Ooh, yeah, bird hiding in a tree. Yeah, <laughs> I like that a lot. It, it. I'll tell you what. It's way different from what they drop normally. I wouldn't think this is a steel hat if you, if you ask me. Way, way different. Okay, fair enough. Uh, second keeper. <laughs> of- <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, okay, man. Fair enough. Whatever. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna waste energy arguing. Uh, second keeper of the week, Pro Image Sports Colorado came with the plug pack. Um, any one of these hats um, could have been the specific keeper. I like the ones from Detroit specifically, but, you know, the whole pack was good. Other than 
I'm with you guys. Other than that, Colorado Rockies black. That Panthers. Yankees hat was. I hate. I hate Yankees hats, man. I fucking hate them. But that Yankees <laughs> hat is really well. That Yankees hat is really well done, man. Yeah, it and really is. And the, the Cartier yeah. can kind of dub as like a Detroit Red Wings hat, like Pat said. It's just a really good pack. The Big Meech is the best by far. Okay. <laughs> Leon again is like, yeah, okay, man. Whatever. Okay, Leon, no, I like yeah, the, I like the, I like the, the best part. I like I the mean, in your opinion, sure. Well, a lot of people say that the big meat is the best. Good for them. Oh, for them. oh, that makes it that makes it right then. Okay, did I sorry. Pick, did I, which one did I pick when we did the when big we did beach. the review? I did right. Yeah, yeah. I just wish there was more detail in the patches on the Detroit's. That's what that's what's really stopping me yeah. from loving those hats. You the, know, in all honesty, word. Lonnie, a lot of the guy, a lot of people that like put together these hats, man. I know you guys have probably done your own collabs, but like it's like they get simplistic with a side patch because they're complex sometimes, and they just mm. they default to a couple of colors. When what sets them apart is when you can add another color that, like you know, you're a sneaker guy, so you look at some, you look at a maroon, you know that like a green is going to go nice in there too, or something else. And, some of these folks don't – they're not connecting it yet. And it's not because they're not they are not good at what they're doing. They're just not there yet. They're not that makes sense. experienced that's enough. A good, that's a good perspective. I think of it. That Boston side patch is beautiful. Though. It that's is. what I'm saying. You look at that and the Yankee and then you look at the – Yeah, but again, there's like three colors in that thing besides the white. You know, it's not like mm-hmm. – it's not super sophisticated, mm-hmm. you know. And you look at the Detroit. You nailed it, man. That Detroit, the, the big Meech one, the thing – Maybe the right thing was to keep it that simple, but it, it is fundamentally only three colors. There's a black, a silver, and white. Yeah, yeah the silver and the white's too close. They almost it's because the BMF color. logo. No, I get it, Snap. Like I, I it's not about like knocking somebody's work down. What I'm saying is is that like there are times like where you should add some more color to a side patch, but some folks just aren't comfortable to do it yet. Yeah, you're right. I'm one of those people. There's nothing wrong with that. Experience, no. you know. Yeah, experience. Um, it comes. Look at someone like Dion Point doing sneakers for like concepts. Like it, you know, he didn't just that didn't happen to him overnight. Right. Mm-hmm. You know. Yeah. Um. I saw a lot of people dog in this collection, the brownstone. Uh, I don't know why. Maybe, maybe it's the canvas. Um. And some people might not be comfortable with that. That's cool. But I, uh, I really like this this collection. I like the DC one a lot. I like the how the you know, it's it's muted colors, but they work together. And uh, yeah, I I was a big fan of this one. What do you wait, Jason? Let me ask you something. What do you mean the canvas? The 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 material is cotton canvas. It's gonna be different from this. Yeah, it's different than poly. Yeah. It's gonna be one of the little Lucy Lucy hats. No, 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 no. Think Carhartt. Think your Carhartt jacket. Oh, yeah. oh okay. Yeah. All right. Will be my first one. Yeah. Some people like them. Some people don't. But well, not. I think I think the problem comes in with the black ones, right? Because the black ones look ashy sometimes, or like yeah. duster. Yeah. But if you do yeah. it with like a navy, or you do it with this color, it's gonna look. It looks good. It looks better, and it doesn't. The thing with these are they're they're sturdier. You know what I mean? It's like yeah. it's like workwear. Yep. That's what it feels like. It's a little heavier material than your poly. Yeah, mm. I like this front logo. Is that two different colors or is it one? No, it's no, two. It's, it looks like a burnt two, orange right? and then a burgundy. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's the same. There's two colors, but because you have raised embroidery on the out, like the outline starts flat and then it comes up and is part of the part of the raised embroidery. So it makes it look like it's more. Uh, it looks like it's two different colors, but it's one. Mm. Oh, all right. I like that effect. Yeah, good picture. All right. And yeah, um, I'm usually not a fan of this these new Guardian color or these new Guardian logos, but I I like the way this one was put together um, with the black and the red and the blue. Uh, I think uh, our friend Gate Crasher did a good job putting this one together. Yeah, it's uh, good hat. And 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 Brooklyn Caps, thanks sir uh, for for throwing this one out. Yes. Green bottom too. All right. Yeah, I like the Guardian script. So for my first uh, keeper of the week, I went to Hat Dreams. Uh, Hat Dreams has been doing this thing now where on the weekends they're dropping a couple of like 
of like uh, really good hats, like randomly throughout the weekend. And last mm-hmm. weekend it was this Washington Nationals and this and this Houston Astros uh, black uh, black caps with uh, gold and red. Um, if I had to pick between the two, I'm going with the Washington Nationals actually. Um, the Astros is nice. They went all gold when there's a lot of striation in that logo, but that Washington Nationals is just sick. Mm-hmm. Um, that's my first keeper of the week coming out of Hat Dreams. And my second keeper of the week Ooh. comes from my fittings. Now, the black one isn't out, out yet, but these Birmingham Baron hats, you can't go wrong, man. I know there's a lot of connection to uh, Michael Jordan with the Birmingham Barons, which is what I think makes it more, so popular. But yes. that, old, that old English B is just, is just really, really good. I like this better than the original Bubba Gump, uh, the red one, um, with that green under. Just really clean. These are, dude. That that black one is an everyday hat, man. You could just you could have that thing ready to go every day, and it doesn't matter what you're wearing. That thing's gonna be clean. Um, so that's my second keeper of the week coming out of my fitteds. Um, the pair of Birmingham uh, Birmingham uh, Barons. And with cool. that, listen, I gotta tell you guys, man. This was even more fun having you guys on than I thought it was going to be. It was fantastic <laughs> having you both here. Um, I thought it was going to be fun, but it was even more fun. So I, I, I yeah. appreciate you guys um, being on with us. You guys did a fantastic job. We love your content. Keep it going. Um, you know, we um, we did put you down as one of the um, – for any of you that are looking, if you go to our channel at the bottom, Subway Sounds is uh, one of our um, recommended channels that we put down at the bottom there. So make sure that you are not only – uh, subscribe to their YouTube channel, but also follow both of these guys. You got you got their Instagrams right here, and you got at Off the Dome. I think it's Off the Dome Podcast, right? On Instagram, the Off the Dome Pod, the Off the Dome Pod on on um, on uh, Instagram, and Leon will put that in the description of the video. Make sure you're following these uh, two young men. They did talk shit about me once, but I'm okay. I'm over it. And with that, um, <laughs> we're friends now. I want to thank you guys. I want to know snap, snap talk shit about us every single week. So, I mean, it's... <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, nah, it's all right. Listen, man, I, I think um, I think uh, some of the best relationships that okay, I've ever this had... Guy, this guy right here, this guy right here, he eliminated me in a tournament over a sneaker town and a capsule hat, but it's all gay. It's fucking bullshit. I don't even know what he's talking about. But I will say that the, some of the relationships that are that I've had in my life that have been the most successful are the ones that started from a not such a good place. So that's always a good thing to kind of think about in life. Um, some of your best relationships ended up being uh, from a relationship that you didn't think was going to even be a relationship. So with that, I want to thank everybody for their time with us this evening. I want to thank everyone who watched um, this week in Caps and also this show. We appreciate you. And with that, Leon, big fella, take us away. Yeah, make sure you guys are dropping a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Um, For Ariel, Jason, Leon, Pierre, Lonnie, and Jesus, we're signing out, guys. Stay fitted. See you, everybody. Peace. Brought to you by VFTV.